In this video tutorial, I'd like to take you through installing and configuring the in-series plugin. This is my favorite tool for creating a, a series link or a series of linked blog posts. Let's go straight over to the dashboard of this site now. First thing I'm going to do is install the plugin. So if we go down to plugins, add new. So we're going to search for it in the uh, plugin repository. So it's in hyphen series. Click on search plugins. And it's pulled it back in the search results. So it's called in hyphen series and it's by Travis Snoozy. If we click on install and then install now. And the last part of the process is to activate the plugin. So that's it installed and activated ready for our use. If we scroll down to settings, there's now a series uh, option. These are some quite advanced options. We'll not be touching them in this tutorial, but you can do things like change the uh, CSS classes. So you can change the look and feel of the links. I can change the text of the links. So we've got next to the series, previous and series, that kind of thing. Let's see, we're not really going to touch on that. Let's go straight over and start adding some posts and linking them up. So if we click on posts, add new, Let's post one. Right now, if we go right down at the bottom, what we can do is we can create a new series. We'll call it Series Alpha. We're going to place this one at the start. Save that. And publish that post. So just make double sure. I have seen some issues where it doesn't save it. Exactly, that's what's happened there. So series alpha. We want this to be at the start. So we click on update. All right. If we we'll add a new post. Post two. What we're going to do now is select the series, so a series alpha, and that's going to be at the end of the series. Let's publish that one too. We'll add one more. Let's go to post three. Text. Again, if I scroll down, series alpha, it's going to be at the end, and publish it. Right, let's go back to the front end of our site and have a look at what this has done. So if we have a look at post one, you can see it's created a table of contents. There's post one, post two, post three, and it's created some links there. And there's the content. But what it's also done, it's done a next in series link there. So we'll click on that. That'll take us to post two. And it's got a previous and a next now. So post three. Previous. Previous. We can go back in and rearrange the order of these um, posts. So go to post, edit again. Post three, go right down to the bottom, and then we can change its position relative there. So we can make it first, or we can remove it entirely from the from the series. I hope this video has been useful to you. It's been Neil Matthews from WPD. Bye for now.